Bengaluru saw hundreds of people coming out today to demand a commuter train. The city known for its gridlock roads has 180 kilometers of tracks with more than 40 railway stations and people are now demanding dedicated local trains at a high frequency. College students, techies, workers and several eminent personalities hopped onto a train to make their voices heard. Well, Bangalore has come out in big numbers today and the demand today is for commuter train. Yes, the government wants to put up a steel bridge. The citizens are asking for a commuter train which comes at much lesser cost and with more facilities and uh, more facilities for the people to travel quickly and without spending too much. So, hundreds of people coming out and taking this train from Bangalore Cantonment to Whitefield which is the IT hub of the city demanding that the state government move quickly on this and also the union government to pitch in because uh, for a number of years now this project has been stuck in a limbo with none of the governments whether it's the state or the union government really showing any sort of a political will already around 180 kilometers of track more than 40 stations are presently there for infrastructure and now activists are demanding that this be utilized properly. There have been many constructive suggestions given. Srinivas here has been in uh, consultation with the government over this and various other projects. Srinivas, technically what does it take to make sure that this dream of a commuter train becomes a reality? In terms of infrastructure, what is required? All is required is the will and people wanting to do this. And you hear those screams of people, that's all is required. Once people want it, the government need to bend over backwards to make it happen. It is very much possible. Stop hiding behind excuses and improve the signaling uh, system and get more trains on there. It can be done in six months. can be done in six months and this is the kind of support that we are seeing. College students coming out in hundreds and wanting this particular project because many of them do take this train in a city that's known for its bad traffic, a speed of nine kilometers per hour. That's the traffic movement in the city. A commuter train, they believe, will make their life much more easier and also give them a lot of time. And yes, absolutely, comes at a much cheaper cost of just 10 rupees. With camera person Kumar, Harish Upadhyay, NDTV, Bengaluru.